Check out this cute children's card we're going to make today. And we're going to do the inside and the envelope, all in 10 minutes or less. Join me in the craft room, and I'll show you how. For my card today, I am using Jar of Love, specifically the cute little fish and this leaf spray. I am using the Love What You Do stamp set, and I'm using this image out of it. I have a scrap of Whisper White. I have my Whisper White card base that's five and a half by eight and a half, scored at four and a fourth. I have my envelope. I'm going to be using the Everyday Jar Framelits, specifically the Goldfish fish. I have my piercing mat because I have to use that when I stamp that background piece. And I'm going to be using Mango Medley, Pool Party, and Garden Green ink. So the first thing I want to do is I want to, oh, I want to try and open this. If you, all right, if you open it wrong, oh, I'm trying. Mm. All right, first thing you, we want to do is we want to stamp our goldfish. So I'm going to stamp my goldfish, or my little fish. Isn't he cute? I love his little lips. All right, and now I need to take and use my die and cut him out. I got my fish cut out, and now it's time to give him some water. He's got to have some water to be in. So what I'm going to take and do is I'm going to use my piercing mat because this image from the Love What You Do um, stamp set, it is Love What You Do, yeah, Love What You Do stamp set, it, it has to have something behind it or the center doesn't come out. So I have found if I use this piercing mat... It works. It needs to be something that we'll see. And you'll see, because you'll see the you'll see it transfer almost immediately. And you can see where it didn't transfer well. So I can press where those are. And it's okay if it doesn't look perfect because this is water. There we go. But see, if I hadn't pressed down there, it would not have come out. So now I've got fish for my water. I've got fish for my water. I've got water for my fish. So I'm gonna put my little fish there, but now I want to add some seaweed. And I don't want the seaweed to go below the water. So I'm just gonna kind of put this post-it note there. And I'm going to ink up my seaweed, so to speak. And I'm going to stamp it here, and I'll stamp it again down there so it's back in the distance. And then see, I can take that off, and it didn't go below my water. Now my little fish has to go on with a dimensional. This is gonna be, this is such a cute card. And you can add more than one fish if you want. I just want one fish. And then what I'm gonna take and do is with my pool party also, I'm gonna stamp, and this is from the Jar of Love, I'm gonna stamp hello right down here. What a great card to send to a, um, a child. They'll love it. And it's done. And I also did the inside and the envelope. I hope you liked my card today. If you did, give me a thumbs up. Feel free to share it. Let's get the word out, ladies. Lots of fun. Have a great day. Check out this cute child children's. Check out this cute. For this card, I am using Jar of Love and I'm specifically using the little solid. Never mind. Hold on. I've got that. So I do need, I don't need the memento. I need the thing. 
mango medley. I have a scrap of mango medley cards. No, I don't need that. We'll start again. Jeez. So, oh, picked up a dragonfly. 